What is up, everybody? Today, we're going to be playing Pokemon Violet here, episode 19. And let's get going. So, last episode, we defeated the Medali Gym right here, aka the restaurant, the treasure eatery. So, next, we're going to be going. Where should we go? I don't see anywhere to go for now. Maybe this. The Dark Crew Base. Um. Um. Let's see. One. One. Two. Three. Four. Oh. All right, um, so today, we're going to be going all the way over here, set as destination, go here, and let's do it. So, today... We're going to the dark type base, which, um, dark types are weak to fighting, fighting, so actually quack would be really good in this case, um, we're gonna do this, uh, I think that's pretty good for now. Um, it's right in front of us. All right, let's do it. Ah, it's you, hang the bank. Clive? Yep, that's me, Clive, the normal academy student. Normal. Sus. Anyway, Hang the Bank, I owe you one. Thanks to you, I've been accepted into Operation Starfall. Why did you join? I, I need answers, that's all. How do I resolve the situation with Team Star and what's causing its members' odd behave, behavior? Whatever. Odd behavior? Team Star is the subject of more than a few nasty rumors swirling around the academy, you know. Some say their bullying, bullying has caused a worrying number of students to drop out of school. Others say they're holed up in their bases, plotting to cause trouble for the academy. Ooh, but these are rumors. The matter I am directly confronted with is something else. I'm talking to about Team Star's whatever currency they've all been skipping classes for a while now five of them in particular the so-called bosses of team star ha haven't so much as set foot inside a classroom for over a year what you could do that <laughs> he can't in real life of course not and it seems the the team's rank and file have recently started stirring up mischief as well, All right? And what else? That's why I took upon it myself to issue a direct order to Team Star to disband, All right? No choice, expel all students. But I'm afraid there's no response. And the deadline I set for them to make their choice between dissolution or ex exclusion is nigh upon us. So you see, I when I overheard you talking to the phone to Castropia, it couldn't have come to at a more crucial time. Can you hear me? Another time then. I 
I see you coming up to one of Team Star's bases. Was there someone else? Some someone with you just now? Nobody. Nobody, dude. Well, be warned that Team Star will have its guard up after losing one boss to you already. Space won't go down easily as the last one. All right. Um, the first three. Go to bag. Low kick. Low kick on Meowskarada. 70s, 80. U turn, night slash. C bomb. Hmm. I don't know what to do. Terra Blast, we got five. Um, okay. Let's go. Um, let's go back to the nearest Pokemon Center real quick because I want to change something, um, really fast. And, um, yeah. Wait, no, not this one. I want to look at this, the TM machine. I want a TM made. What can we make? We got two of these. Um, low kick. One, one more. Perfect, no. One acid spray. We'll do one struggle bug. Um, we already have that. Disarming voice. Let's get one of these. No. All right, so swift. We got one swift already. We got one flame charge. Um, we're gonna get one rest. Why not? Um, nope. Nobody. Yep. Um, that's it. Alright, we're done, and um, we will try to defeat the, um, the Team Star Base coming up. Whoa, whoa, hold it, you. Up ahead, the base of operations for Team Star's Dark Crew. You may know us as the Sagan Squad. Yep, and we don't take too kindly to random kids sniffing around our turf. Sorry, but if you don't turn yourself around here, amigo, we'll have to send you packing. Wait, hold up. Just going to hunt you, but are you that kind of bank kid? You know, the piece of work we're getting out we're out to get for declaring war on Team Star. Maybe I am. Maybe I am, he says. Cool as a cucumber. Honestly, he's not that. He's not. Honestly, not always the best policy, you know. Ugh, you know what? Doesn't matter who you are, you're not getting through. Buzz off or get thrashed by me. In battle, kid. Will be. I'll take you on. Yeah, sadly, kids are like you are the worst. That's it. Prepare to get stomped into the dirt. 
I say it kind of like a weird way, but also a satisfying way, kind of. So, so it has the vibe to it, like how the Team Star say it. So why not? I'm just gonna add it. Quacks coming out. Okay. All right, wait. Wait a second. All right, I'm back. Let's see what she said. Why did such a sassy kid have to be so strong? I'm not sassy. You're the one who's sassy. Right, guys? Grah, how the heck could I lose? All right. Well, whatever. It's your problem now. Finish up. Finish up here for me, would you, bud? Okay, thanks. Hasta la vista. Hasta la vista. She's new to the team, you know. Might have to. Might, might have to have a little chat with her about the attitude side. <laughs> That's fair. Well, I'm gonna go into a base now and give the rest of the squad a heads up. Come at you full force if you set foot inside, so you want to consider turning tail. Either way, best of luck, you, amigo. Has to love you, star. My head is just. My head. I, I noticed my head, like, move, like how the star moves, so that's weird. Super weird. So you took care of the guards. Nice work. Now, hold up. And that base is Team Star's dark crew, the Sagan Squad, their boss. Namiko pretty much runs the whole team. The whole of Team Star. He also produced a wild soundtrack of theirs himself. He's a sharp guy. Even our declaration of war won't have ruffled him in the slightest. His plan is probably to wear you down with a wave of grunts and finish off himself. Don't. No use trying to outthink strategy types like him. Bring down, bring him down with a head-on attack. Okay. Just keep on it, defeating as many Pokemon as you can. Uh, ring the bell and gates once you're ready. Kick off this phase of the operation. Time to sweep. Time to swipe the second squad off the map. Let's see what we can do. Um. Check summary. I think we're good. Yep. Yeah. Let's do it. Wait. What's dark? Type we two. Bug fairies fighting, okay. Bug fairy fighting. Some kid lucked out beating one of our sister's squads. Now he thinks he can take us on. Time to give him the loot, gang. To show this gate crasher what Team Star can do. If it, and if you're late listening, gate crasher, know this. Unless you can beat 30 of our Pokemon in 10 minutes, our boss won't, our boss won't left. Will lift a finger to deal with the likes of you. Right. Sure. Go. Go.
Go, 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 go. Everyone attack. Everyone attack. No. Attack. Go, attack. Come on, please. Here we go, attack. Attack. Two Pokemon should be enough. Perfect. Okay, go. Go. Um, we'll do all three of you guys. That should be good. Um, oh, there we go. We got some. Go. Where? Here we go. That was easy. All right, so bug fairy fighting. Bug fairy fighting. All right, fair enough. Guard of War is actually good in this battle. So. Bug fairy fighting. Can I just write this down? Bug fairy fight fighting. You've done a real number on us, party crash crasher. I'm the bank, was it? I'm Giacomo at the deck. I go by DJ Vice. Call me whichever. It's survive either way. Nice to meet you at all. And all, but but we skip straight on you. I'll roll. Don't worry, I'll play you sick, Queen, as you crash and burn. Let's get this party started. That's good, right? That's good enough. This vibe. I kinda like this. This is vibing. It's a good song though. We'll do air slash. We didn't flinch. Oh man. Right. Flinch, please. That's it? Two Pokemon? Time to up the tempo. This this show ain't over yet. Well that's right. Sure. Well, all right. Oh, wow. This is too easy. This is too easy. These are too easy. One more? This should be good. There we go. I like the sound. I mean, I like the song though. Guess that's that. Another one, about a year and a half ago. <clears throat> Guess that's that. What's up? 
Giacomo, did something happen? The big boss just wanted me to take on some stuff. So we chat so we had a chat and settled a few plans on a few plans. A few plans, like for what? I'll bring star first of all and also a new code of conduct for the team. And you know how ton how tons of new members have joined up recently? Well we figure you gotta make some team rules like a code so we'll all be on the same page. Nice. Come up with a great code for us, won't you? Giacomo? Nah. Ha, no thanks. Way too much pressure. I, I mean, yeah. I used to be president of a school council, but you know everyone ended up hating me after that, right? Of course we know. We forced a ton of fluffy rules on everyone, and they want to take it. We got some other nerd to replace you after like five minutes. Cannot help but conquer male students hair strain no further than an inch 1.8 inch below the nape and so forth your rules were vexing your man face my point exactly so you all agree that i shouldn't be anywhere near this new code but you always know what's best for a team giacomo you look out for us and i'll trust many times over without you team star wouldn't just won't work that's that stuck up student council press isn't who you are anymore, man. Co written by the Gio Giacomo I'm looking at now. I'd follow that any day. As would I. Okay, okay. Thanks for the ego boost, everyone. I'll do it. Alright, I'm dark code. Dark code. I did the best I could with that code myself. There's no going back on it for now. My days are as a boss are over. So you're taking my star badge, would you? Um, I think this is easier than Bella, honestly. I'll give you this choice, TM2. You're in the fair and square. We earned flow, the not flow, foul play. There we go. Ha, so this is how the party ends. But let's talk about those Pokemon of yours. They're crazy strong, huh? You learned those trainer chops at the academy, like what moves you, you should use and stuff? Uh, nope. Huh, okay, you like it at the academy, having fun? I enjoy it. No kidding. Sorry to interrupt, but are you Giacomo? Whoa, ho. Wasn't expecting a giant pom pompadour to make a guest appearance today. Get a Quaxwell to style up that for you. Just a quick word. Would you mind? Sure. Tell it's going to be something annoying, but I guess I'm nearly freed up for time. Thanks. I'll get straight to it. Seems that all, in, are, all of you in Team Star are headed for explosion, right? If you keep up your current activities. So why do you break up the team and start attending class at Academy again? That's, that's what you want to know? And it happens that we're, we're actually waiting on a pal. pal. Though we don't that we don't know if they're coming back. They'll be coming back. Close friend of yours, yours, are they? They're only the strongest boss in all of Team Star. Like there's a top champion who's the absolute number one trainer, you know? They're the one who invited us other bosses to form a, the team. We call him the big boss. And where's this big boss of yours now? Wouldn't, wouldn't we like to know? We haven't heard from from him and I don't know, it must be a year and a half ago now. We thought that we kept Team Star going, then they'll be they'll get back in touch one day. But teachers keep pressing us to call it quits and and we got we get party crashers like you two. Maybe the big boss did catch did did us. They were talking about breaking up the team before and all. So Team Star, this big boss of yours, they're really that important to you? Hey, isn't the sky blue? Let me put it in words you, you eggheads at the academy might understand. They're my greatest treasure. Alright. So that's it for today's episode. I think...
and if you want more of these kind of episodes, or like Sword and Shield or Pokemon Legends Arceus or anything, please like and subscribe, and we will see you guys in the future episodes. Wait, we got more cutscene. Hang the bank, it's me. I take it that Giacomo Star Badge is now in your hand. In possession? I see. That was his boss out of the picture. The Sagan Squad is pretty much done for. Giacomo. Sorry, I got dis distracted for, for a second there again. Now, about your reward. I transfer some LP to your phone. phone as, prom as promised. I can't say anything anymore. <clears throat> I can make more kinds of TMs. Those are some new TMs to strengthen your Pokemon even further. I'll have my supply unit reap rep meet you shortly to def to deliver some bonus materials too. All right. Uh, hello, it's me again from the supply unit. Yeah. What, what the heck? What's going on? Oh, he saw that. All right, here we go. Somebody help! What's gonna happen? Bletch, it drooled all over me. What even is that Pokemon anyway? I have no idea what that is. <laughs> I'm amazed you're so calm with the giant question mark of a Pokemon I decide. Uh, um, before I forget, here's the reward. <clears throat> um, your name's Hang the Bank, right? So you're part of Operating Starfall's battle unit. Can I ask you something? What do you think of Thief Star? They're pretty strong. <clears throat> They're not bad. They're not the greatest, though. Interesting. Now, some of the rumors say Team Star wasn't a bunch of delinquents. Some of them used to be victims of, of bullying or found it, find it hard to interact with people. But these are but these misfits and, and outsiders found each other and banded together f to form Team Star. They all wanted to do was push back against the bullies and, and they couldn't face alone. But, uh... That's just info I got by hacking other students' social media accounts. I also found I also found talk about some secret mastermind behind the five boxes. Someone who recruit, recruited them all to the team in the first place. Hmm. I don't normally talk this much. Now my throat kind of hurts. So um, good luck with taking down the other races and stuff. Right. So this is the end. Please like and subscribe, and we will see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.